So if you're struggling with putting some vibrato on top of a bend, here's a quick tip for you guys. So here's what that would sound like. So for this example, I just wanna start off by saying this is not the only way to do it. This is not the best way. This is just the way that works for me and a lot of my students. So when you create a bend, you can do this wherever you want, of course. You have a couple options of where you're gonna create the vibrato motion from. So first would be from your fingers themselves, like this. I don't personally prefer this. It feels kind of awkward and wonky. What I like to do is lock my fingers in and then use my wrist to create the motion. A lot more power there. Also, notice where my thumb is placed. Usually, it's on top of the neck or really close to it. And then also, my first finger kind of index like callus area is kind of holding the neck nice and snug. So now from that point, I can kind of just pivot with my wrist to create the vibrato motion. So give it a try. See you in the next video.